Hello people, um, this video is going to be pretty different from most of my regular videos. It's this like bluey infected alternate universe kind of story thing that this guy R random underscore human on Instagram has made. I wouldn't really call it an infected alternate universe, um, but I'll get to that later. I've been following this series since like the first um, little comic came out. So basically what you need to know is it's this comic series made by um, our random underscore human on Instagram featuring like Bluey's family and like cousins and stuff. They're trying to navigate through this world where suddenly like people can kind of just become crazy wolf-like and then they um start attacking people currently we're on comic number six it's a pretty new series after seeing comic number six i kind of had this theory brewing in my mind and i was like man oh, maybe some people would like to hear this right now i just want to say everybody if you haven't seen this um comic series yet it's really awesome um please go check it out R random underscore human on Instagram. Really cool, a little bit spooky. Definitely go check that out and then come back to this video. Hi to all the people who just came back after um, going through all the comics. First thing I wanna say is um, I'm not gonna call them infected because you, you can see like in the comic, uh, they say multiple times, it's not an infection, it's not a virus. It's something different, okay? So from now on, I'm just gonna call them destroyed. So these, these, these characters are here. Um, I'm now gonna refer to them as the destroyed. Here's a couple of things that um, I wanna point out about the damaged. They seem wild and not in control. I think this is pretty similar to the movie Zootopia where um, a main part of the story is they have this thing called night howler chemicals. And basically when it's given to an animal in Zootopia, they become quite aggressive and they go back to their like savage kind of wild ways right another thing i'd like to point out is that in one of the comics it's mainly focused on bandit and you can see bandit is still conscious he's completely aware of what's going on but he has no control at all something else i'd like to point out is there's this one there's this one comic where uncle rad is feral you know and he's going to attack um the healers uncle stripe comes out of nowhere and hits him with a wrench and i don't know if he's knocked out or dead there's a scene where he's like lying against it Bluey's like, we can't leave Uncle Rad there, but Chili's like, I'm sorry, Bluey, we have to go. When you look at Uncle Rad in this picture, you can see there's almost like some kind of smoke or fog around him. And then there's a scene of Bluey looking at him, and then he looks normal again. I don't know if there's some kind of hallucination thing there, or like only the adults can see the feral form, or maybe that kind of smoke or fog was like the thing that caused this leaving um now that brings me on to my next part now we know that um it's caused by some kind of red smoke um and you can even see this part where bandit says like he, he inhaled something right and now he's he's this form he's this way so i'm just wondering if that scene with uh, uncle rad is kind of like the the smoke like leaving because he's no longer a suitable host or whatever something like that we obviously know what causes this it's the it's the red smoke but like what is the red smoke i believe the red smoke is some kind of a smoke derived from poppies in the popular game poppy playtime they have something similar in the game it's this like red kind of smoke or fog derived from poppies i was looking up what kind of effects poppies have on dogs if consumed some effects that poppies have on dogs is crying, um, pinpoint pupils, or staring off into space. Let me just explain these further. Um, there's obviously that one scene of Bandit where he's crying because he's stuck in his body. And also the pinpoint pupils. Look at look at this. Look at these. These all have the that kind of very small pinpoint pupils. And there's a couple of them where, like, even this one with... Um, Uncle Rad, it's just, it doesn't seem like he's staring directly at them. He's kind of staring off into space. It almost seems that way, right? 
However, there are some things that would disagree with my points. Um, for one, it says inappetence, which is loss or lack of appetite. In the comics, you can you can see they don't really they don't have a loss of appetite. They actually have a gain in appetite for the other people. Also here where it says it could result in sedation, they don't seem very sedated at all. So I, I think that could disprove my theory. The only thing I can't um, figure out is like where it could possibly be coming from. It could be some sort of a gas leak and it would affect kind of everyone. So I'm not sure how it would only affect specific characters um, and not like the whole family or stuff like that. Anyway, that's where I'm at for now. Wait, 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 wait. I just wanted to borrow your attention for a little bit longer. Um, just while I was editing this thing, I realized that in that one scene, like before Bandit turns uh, feral, you can see he's holding like a bowl of cherries or some kind of red berry or something. And I do think this kind of relates to that um, one scene with Aunt Trixie saying like, they didn't get the full radio message, but they did hear something about red and something about smoky and so they decided to stay away from all red things i don't think there's a way berries could be smoky i don't know um so i think those red berries are actually a red herring but i could be wrong they could be more important than i think but for now with the information i know i'm just gonna say that it is probably 99 percent some sort of red smoke yeah anyway please 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 go check out our random underscore human on instagram to keep up with this series it's very interesting and uh i'm excited to see the rest of the story um but yeah if any of y'all have theories drop them in the comments um and yeah thanks for watching